Lily and Jane have a great idea. They want their own little house in the backyard. It's going to be a whole mansion, Bestie. I know. We'll build a palace. Let's get started. We'll put up the walls first. And then we'll do the roof. What's going on? Rain is the last thing we need right now. That's not fair. The weather ruined all our plans. Lily, are you thinking what I'm thinking? That's right. A wow. hanging house right in this room. Just imagine. A space right under the ceiling. Oh, yes. And we'll decorate it how we want. Get to work. Now. And let's start by decorating the ceiling. Make it look like the sky. This should be enough. Let's attach the blue tool to the ceiling. We'll use double-sided tape. Here you go, Jane. Teamwork makes the dream work. Don't forget this too, bestie. LED lights. That's a great idea. The sky will glow. The more light, the better. Wow! The new ceiling looks really nice. We did it, Jane. But there's still a lot of work to do. Let's not stop. We have to take out the furniture. Get rid of all this extra stuff. This will soon be a completely different room. Yay! The construction site is cleared. What's next? We need a lawn, Jane. Good thinking, Lily. Let's roll out the grass. The lawn is almost ready. Looks like a real lawn, right? And now for the fun part. Let's make the base for the hanging house. Connect the two wooden trays. Let's fasten chains to the corners. Self-tapping screws plus a screwdriver will make sure it stays on. Your turn, Lily. It's easy. And the task is done. All that remains is to hang them from the ceiling. Easy peasy. And now let's test our house. And it passes the test of strength. Lily, what about the walls? I have an idea, Jane. We'll need a few planks. Measure and cut them. Now we can assemble the frame for the walls. Almost a construction set. But we need a screwdriver. And all the beams are on. Time to think about the roof. We'll make it triangular. Go for it, Lily. What are we going to make the walls out of? Cardboard, obviously. It's fast and easy. Let's attach the walls with staples. You don't even need nails. The furniture stapler is the perfect invention. And we can remove what we don't need with a box cutter. Cardboard is the best building material. And the door is on. All that's left to do is cut through a couple of windows. Jane can handle it. Wow! Now we put the roof back on. Lily, help! Yay! The house is almost ready. Next up, we want to add some bricks. Jane, look what I have. Scissors, get to work. Cut the insulation into strips. And then divide it into small bricks. And we don't need cement. Creative builders use hot glue. The first brick is already on the wall. Moving on. Not an easy task. We need to cover the whole house with bricks. But it's more fun to work as a team. We did it, Jane! That looks good. Now let's get to painting. Let's make the bricks pink. This is the best color for the hanging house. The work is in full swing. The main thing is not to miss a single brick. Wow! The house is getting better and better. While Lily finishes the walls, Jane takes care of the roof. Let's give it a tile shape. It turned out great. Now the wallpaper, Jane. Go ahead, bestie. 
With decorations like that, no one would ever guess that the house has cardboard walls. Gluing wallpaper is so easy. Wow! How beautiful, Lily! This floral wreath goes over the door. And this house needs a rug. Jane, catch this! The rug blends in nicely. We'll also put a nightstand here. And a couple of nice knickknacks. Of course, it's much cozier now. And now let's make it comfy. The beanbag chair is already here. Couch cushions? Give me two. The plush octopus gets the most honorable cushion. Now it's a house of superior comfort. And more plants. Lily, all that's left is to deal with the curtains. Let them be pink, too. They are so cute. It turned out great. And let's decorate the ceiling with blue tulle. We need to tuck in all the edges. Perfect. What about the light? Lily already thought of everything. We don't need light bulbs. It's too easy. There's a night light. Attach it to the ceiling and we're done. Everything is going according to plan. Soon, we'll have a whole house. What is that? Hmm. We can use this. Jane, I have an idea. Let's make a soft rug. And it's really simple. Just wrap the thread around our fingers and make little balls. Watch and learn, Jane. Tie the ball together. That's it. And now cut around the edges. Voila! We made a pom-pom. Let's make more. That's nice. But we're not done yet. Let's decorate this mat with pom-poms. Tie them up row after row. The brighter the rug, the better. And the rainbow rug is ready. Soft as a cloud. The house is ready to welcome guests. But we're not done. Lily, we need a swing right away. This is what we'll make it out of. Oh, yes. We could use a strong rope. Let's pull the rope through the base all the way to the knot. But the seat is too stiff. We'll fix it. Thank you, Lily. That's much better. And we'll attach the other end of the rope to the ceiling. We did it! It's working! I'll go first, Lily! Oh, yes! The swings are working properly! Jane, don't be greedy! It's my turn now! Whatever you say! Yay! I love swinging! Lily, we have a problem. It's completely empty around the house. And this flower is awfully boring. That's easy to fix, Jane. Let's make a paper palm tree. I'll show you how. Fold a sheet of crepe paper. Trim it. And then make cuts around the edge. That's great! Now put the pieces on the wire. Give it the shape of a branch. And add a paper leaf on top. And don't forget to tape it. The leaves look just like the real thing. But they're pink. Let's make a lot of them. And the palm itself will be made of wood. Let's put the plant in this pot. Lily and Jane are born gardeners. Attach the palm branches to the trunk. Masking tape always comes in handy. And our palm tree is already blooming. What if it glows? Wrap an LED tape around the trunk and put white tulle on top. The fairy tale tree is ready. Let's put the palm tree on display. We'll leave all the boring stuff outside. Let's turn on the lights. It looks magical. 
Lily! This needs to be celebrated! How about some goodies? I'd love to! Lily, it's too early! We'll make fondue! Don't worry, it won't take long! I promise! Just cut open an empty tin and we put a candle inside! And on top will be a cup for heating! This is where we melt the chocolate! Light it up, Lily! Soon the chocolate will be soft! In the meantime, you can prepare the marshmallows! Chocolate first, then sprinkles! It's done! It's time to taste it! Delicious! A picnic in your own room is so much fun! It smells amazing in here! Wow! We have guests! Wow! A hanging house! Is that an earthquake? Oh no! It's just Jessica! Come on in! Help yourself! Mmm! Marshmallows and chocolate! That's the good life! It's wow. a swing! Can I? Sure, Jess! Don't be shy! Woohoo! The swing in the room is a million dollar idea! But it's time for a tour of the house! It looks like a gingerbread oh. palace! Make yourself at home, friend! It's even better on the inside! So stylish! So comfy! There are even curtains! And everything is so soft! The hanging house is a dream come true!